Welcome back, guys, to part two of episode four, Sons of Winter. So basically, Carrot here, we're looking for a way out here to prevent our son, our head, from taking out of our shoulders. That's what frostbite. Oh, what's from? rotten? This is all bloody useless. Bloody onions and crab apples. Well, I pick one. At least I won't starve to death. Okay. If I ever find a way out of here. Let us see. What can we find? Must be the latrine. I'm not sticking around to use it. Okay, what else? Oh, there's a knife. Ooh. Is it a knife? Oh. That might be useful. Trouble. Indeed. Nothing else? I think it's... There's something here. Blanket. I'll bring Probably it. Probably covered with fleas. Uh, okay, fine. You struggle with... Oh, come on. Why am I not pressing it? There you go. Someone's Jared! Oh, it's you! Cotter, what are you doing here? I heard him talking. You're to be executed in the morning. What about Finn? He told Nobody them... Nobody believes him. Or don't want to. They think he's covering for you. Some are even saying he helped you do it. I have to get out of here. That's why I came. I want to help. Oh, that's good. Or you'd be executed too. Why would you want to help me? I told you my secret. And you said you were my friend. Well, what kind of friend would I be if I left you to die here? Oh. So I'm getting you out of here. I don't want to hear any complaining. You're a good man. You know that. You're so sweet. Don't go singing my praises just yet. Okay. I want you to take me with you. To the North Grove. Oh. You know I can't stay here. I'm leaving Castle Black. But I'd rather not go it alone. So if you're going north, I'm coming with you. That's good. The more the merrier. Well, I'm not going anywhere unless I can get out of this bloody storeroom first. I can try and pick the lock, but I'm not sure it will work. Okay, let's proceed with this one. Maybe this will work, right? Garrett, what are you doing? Getting out of here. Okay, help me out, owl. Help. Chip. There you go. Chip this one. There you go. So cool. Only one and one, and it's... Whoa, I can see it. it. It's coming loose. I'm gonna try to push it out. You pull, all right? Is it push, really? Oh. There you go. I hope no one heard that. I hope so, or else... Hey, Where's can you fit through? I think. Oh, uh, let's fit on here. Uh. Before anyone, anyone will spot us. Okay. I'll wait for your signal, Carter. I don't know why I'm talking like this. <laughs> okay. How are you doing? There was... There was a Yuki. Oh my god, my heads are itchy now. I don't know. Why is it always like that? If when I'm just playing here or nothing to do, it's, it will not be itchy. But when I'm recording, then it will be itchy. Weird. Come on. Furthermore, Garrett. <laughs> oh shit! Oh crap. Aren't you two idiots lucky I'm not Frostfinger? Thought you were being sly, eh? I figured you'd try something like this. It worked, didn't it? Finn, you bastard. What are you doing here? I'm the sword in the darkness. Helping a fellow brother keep his head. Ooh. You'll need this. Now, let's go. You're not coming with us, Finn. What are you on about? Frostfinger already thinks I'm helping you. What do you think he's gonna do when he is? You've run off with potato fucker over here. 
I'd rather take my chances with you. And I'm good in a fight. You know that. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that. good at starting them anyway. Come on, Carter. You'll need another blade at your side. Three's better than two. Having another ranger along couldn't hurt. Till he stabs you in the back. No, he will not. We'll talk later. <laughs> move. Let's move. Come on, Finn and Carter. We're the GFC. G. F. C. C. G. F. Why there's no C? There's two C. <laughs> G. F. C. Yeah, it should be four letters, right? G. <sighs> F. <sighs> Run for your lives. You can do it, Garrett. Oh, here's the... There's no turning back now. We're deserters, for sure. Indeed we are We're now. We're breaking our vows. I've taken plenty of oaths. Broken plenty, too. Yeah. Words don't mean shit. There'll be a price on our heads. My family back home is counting on me to put things right. And I mean to do it. Vows aren't going to stop me. Moving on. Oh my god, maybe that's a signal that someone... They know we're gone now. Yeah, I knew it. Then how fast can you run? Let's go! <laughs> Achievement unlock. Pride and purpose. Okay, we're back here with the guards. Huh. Are we just going in there and show them our guards? Oh my god, the village people are all struggling. They're so hungry and nothing to eat. It's worse than I thought, isn't it? Roderick! There you are. Lady Forrester! What's wrong, Mother? It's Griff. He was arguing with the maester, and things got out of hand. Uh-oh. I'm coming. What do you mean to do? Th this could be our chance. He's right. We must hurry before things get violent. I'll make sure the maester is safe. That's what matters. Just don't forget your promise, Roderick. Yeah, don't The rest worry. of my men are still in the grove. They could be here in minutes. Make sure they're ready to do some damage. Sounds like a good time. Let's go. Let's Another. go. Listen for my signal. I'll strike my cane when I want you to enter. Okay. We'll be ready. And no guards of... I mean, the guards of Greek should have someone here outside too, right? I'm coming with you. It's not safe. You should wait for your brother. I don't care if it isn't safe. Griff thinks I belong to him. I need to show him I don't. I think that's a Together, bad then. idea. No. It's a bad idea. Roderick. can not let her. And I badly need a new computer. My laptop can't handle even just this game. But the thing is, I have no budget yet. I tried to heal it, but the wound didn't respond. Oh, oh no, Mister! Why? You let that bite fester. No, I tried. <laughs> You'd have tried harder for a foster. Oh my God, you bullies! Please. I am the only lord who matters here. Roderick! Help me. Tell your dog to obey his new master. And while you're at it, Elena Glenmore? What are you doing with him? You're supposed to be marrying you? me! I'd rather marry a dead horse. You watch your bloody tongue. Let the maester go, Griff. Not until he's learned his lesson. Elysium. He's disobedient, just like you were, Roderick, <laughs> before I brought you to heal. 
So now he's paying the price. Oh, crap! What the? Sorry. I'm sorry. Don't believe you. You're not the Lord here, Griff. And I'm tired of you pretending you are. You think I'm fucking pretending? Yes, you are. You know what I think? You're not the legit one here. My brother is ready. I think you need another lesson in humility. Just like your maester here. You can watch if you like. Careful, Griff. You really don't want to do that. And why the fuck not? Come on. You planning to stop me? Yes, I will. <laughs> oh, what's the cripple up to now, eh? Fancy yourself a warrior? You are nothing, Roderick. Just give up. Not today. Accept it. You're just embarrassing yourself. There you go. That's... Oh, yes. What the hell is this? What are your orders? I'm the only one here who gives the orders. What are you waiting for? Help the maester. What are you doing? Back away. Yep. Now. This is my hall. You have no right to be here. Oh, yeah. Now then. About humility. Get your hands off me. My father will go straight to Roost Bolton. I did warn you, Griff. Yes, I did. You gonna hurt me? Your friends won't be around forever, Roderick. And when they're gone, I will see that you... What? <laughs> Another one. Of course, I'm not getting Is this the man you'd rather you. have? This... Wanna be Roderick! Easy on enough! You. That's enough! Are you satisfied? <laughs> Last one. You need to stop. My eye! Mother. Roderick, listen to you me! Fucking! My eye! I can't see! Mother. I can't. I can't fucking see. There you go. Not least I could do. Confine the White Hills to the cellars. No one gets in or out. Oh, yes. Bye, Griff. But the thing is, I think I made a bad decision here, huh? I think I did. I bet my mom were gonna tell me. Word cannot reach High Point. You must be sure of it. Not as long as they still hold Ryan. Kill the ravens. All of them. Oh. That's a good idea, mother. So, or should I say, in the new generation, kill I the internet. I will. <laughs> Fuck you and your queen. That's enough! So long as you're in my Leshka. camp, you will obey my orders. And getting pissed drunk before a mission. Obey? You know what kind of shit brain fool does that? What One who wants to fucking die style? out there! Have you lost your damn mind? I am not some animal in a cage! Hey, 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 calm down! Calm down! What's going on here? I'm not the one with the problem. It's him. She can't fight like this, Asher! You think I'm too drunk to fight? What the fuck what do you What are you, you gonna know? do? Run out there swinging a fucking... Ah! Ow! Oh! Now. Still think I can't fight? You fucking bitch! Oh, there we go. Hey, come on, Beska. Leave the poor Let man alone. Let go of me before I break your fingers. Deal with your friend. She'll get us all you killed. You sound scared, Croft. This is bloody important. You afraid your mother will spank you? I will not let you two fuck... Mind your own business, Croft. You don't need to worry about us. Just take care of this. Because if she can't hold it together, we're leaving without the both of you. Uh-oh. <laughs> you think your little thumbcock can take Marine all by itself? 
I'd never work with a bloody show like you Beska, anyway. what the hell is going on? Yeah. You gonna lecture me too? <gasps> <gasps> Croft doesn't know shit about anything. None of you do. Oh, Croft. Fuck Croft. You think I give two shits about what Croft has to say? <gasps> Come on, Beshka, stop <gasps> it. <gasps> Your fucking uncle is the only reason I'm even here. He told your little dragon queen I would go into marine with you. You brought me here. Just talk to me, Beska. We're done talking. Oh, oh my on, god, Asha. you're one strong woman. Oh, if this was a real fight, you'd be dead. I'm not going to do that. Ow, Bashka! Uh oh. Come on, come on. Whatever your problem is with Marine, you have to get over it. Get over it! I was a slave! Okay. Here, in this fucking city. So that's the reason, then. You walk away and... Oh, should I say... I was taken from my home when I was only three years old. When I was seven, my master threw me in the fighting pit to die. Whoa. When my master mm -hmm. tired of watching me kill animals for sport, he started... Uh-oh. No, don't continue. He started sending other children. Oh, I thought... I butchered every one of them. Oh my god. I... After a while, I thought the fear was gone. But you had no choice. I did. I decided my life was worth saving. But theirs were not. There was this boy. We used to play five stones in the alley when we couldn't sleep. When I saw him next, he was in that pit with me. Uh-oh. I saw the fear in his eyes. That same fear I felt my first time. And I realized it hadn't left me. That's sad. I still wanted to live. I wanted it so badly. My master watched as I did it. Smiling. Um, I'm, I'm so sorry, Beska. I don't want your pity. I bought my freedom a long time ago, but I have always hated this place. Hated him. Desor Zoraza. Desor Because of that man. Marine is a city of dead children. Marine. Don't worry about me. I won't let you down. Oh, thank you. I know you won't. I like the character of Asher, actually. How I wish I have those kinds. You know, you're being cocky and funny in a way that... Uh, I know, if, he, if he's the one talking to you or something, you'll be always get annoyed, but you know... <laughs> You shouldn't say that. <laughs> oh, Sarah, Why not? Sarah. Mira, I'll meet you inside. Sarah's busy with his prospect What are you doing here? Husband. I have to get in there, Sarah. I know I'm not supposed to attend. But then you know Lady Marjorie doesn't want to see you. What could be so important? Oh. I need to speak with Lords Morgrin and Andros. One of them might be working against my family. Doing what? If I knew that, I wouldn't be here. Look, I can't get you in. Marjorie's already furious with you. And I'm not really interested in joining you on her bad side. Please, Sarah. I know you're probably angry with me, but I need your help. As much as I wanted to be I don't know. And speak Please. about her secret. But you know, when you ask 
somebody for help, you should be... Fine. But you owe me, understand? No, you don't. <laughs> She's with me. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. Okay, here we go. Thanks, Sarah. I like the hair. How I wish I could do my hair like that. But the thing is, my hair is It's a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. Tommen is our king now. Long may he reign. Sarah! I was worried you'd run off with your friend there. And what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. Oh. This is Lady Mira Forrester. Mira, Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Where have you been hiding her? You're making her blush. <laughs> you flatter me. Sarah's lovelier than us all. I won't argue there. Mm -hmm. It's quite a feast, isn't it? Just be careful around the wine. Though I hear you don't partake yourself. It's easy to forget. Nothing you do in King's Landing goes unnoticed. Drink too much once and you're forever the drunken fool. Oh, Talk yeah. to the wrong people. Oh, and... Lord Tarwick! Uh oh, who's that guy? Oh. What was that about? Nothing. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. <gasps> My ears are not delicate. Of course they are. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> Let alone oh, stop it. <laughs> they what? Too. I mean it. Is there someone you'd rather be talking to? Yes. I'm sorry, I... I I'm, I'm rather thirsty. Oh, allow me. No, I can get it myself. Thank you. If you'll excuse me. You'll excuse me, madame. This reminds me of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe them. You told me this story. But you would have loved oh, it. Too. We danced all evening, drank wine from our helmets. That and is food. it! Andros, you're being ridiculous! Why, what's the matter? Uh oh, sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Who is helping? These are just the crowd. Let's eavesdrop these people. No, we're not gonna eat. Let's just look for the view. Look at the view, I mean. My god, <gasps> my grammar. It seems so calm out there. That's what I like about doing this thing, is, you know. It helps me a lot with how I speak. I heard he was killed. Right here in the garden. Well. Wasn't he a Lannister? One of their guard, but still. Surely they found who did it. No, they haven't caught him yet. Not for lack of effort, mind you. I hear they've spared no expense. Okay, so nothing on that side. Let's not be too Moving on. Music! And why would you ever stop dealing ironwood? Mm, is there no longer a demand for them? I can't imagine that would be the case. <sighs> no need for such wild speculation. I've simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. Hmm, and what would that be? <laughs> no, no, no. I can see what you're doing. I'm not giving away my secrets just yet. Oh, so they're not interested in the ironwood, so that's why. You have. Oh, I can't remember. I, I think it was a bird? Mm, close. A cock. That's it. <laughs> no, that's terrible. You're the one telling the joke, oh, remember? Come on, guys, get a room. <laughs> There's nothing more left other than this two, right? We need to talk here. Oh, let's eavesdrop first. Let's hear what about the sea. It is a lot, but I know how to spend it. Hmm. But how did you manage it? 
Lord Whitehill trusts me above all others. That's why I'm the only one he's willing to work with. Oh, oh, really? Exclusive deal. How good for you, Andros. Well, I've got my family to consider. When's the last time you even saw your wife, Andros? When? What's wrong with her? Oh, so where do you not hear this guy? Uh, will he talk to me when I look at I recognize that wine. Nope, I will not drink any wines or I'll, I'll get tipsy or whatnot. Just like me in real life. Will I talk to this guy or no, let's talk to this guy first. Morgan. <laughs> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Lady Mira, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? That you aren't currently locked in a cell. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How did you do it, if I may ask? Secret. I wasn't expecting to see you again, if I'm being honest. You must have made quick work of it. If I tell you how I did it, what's in it for me? Yes. <laughs> Nothing. But I admire the gall. The gall? I do believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Secret. Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me... I noticed you and Andros arguing earlier. I'm sorry you had to see that. Yes. I told him it was not the time. For what? What were you arguing about, if you don't mind my asking? Well, a bold question deserves a bold answer, doesn't it? Yes. Please? I've been pushed out of the ironwood business. Oh. All thanks to my partner. Bloody imbecile. Who? Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive contact in King's Landing. Oh. No matter the fact that I introduced them in the first place. That man would be nothing without me. Yeah, How quickly people forget where they started. Do you know what Lord Andros is planning? He's acquired a large amount of gold, but I haven't the slightest idea what he intends to buy with it. Whatever it is, he's managed to get a Lannister involved. A Lannister? Hmm. Lyman. He may only be a third cousin, but he's a Lannister all the same. Oh. <laughs> Rickard, are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. <laughs> Leave him alone. Yeah, what's wrong with Please being excuse me. Okay, your excuse. Go ahead, have fun, enjoy your day, night. Andrews and Layman. Okay, let's talk first to Layman before Andrews. I'm gonna pass you, Tarwick and Sarah. Go get yourself a room. Hmm, do I need to talk to him first? Oh, oh, you, oh my god! Guys, sorry, I didn't notice the time's ready. <laughs> Almost 30 minutes. Thanks again for watching. Hope to see you again next time. Bye! And smile always.